Hello and welcome, this is STR Rank. Today I'm playing Armored Core 6 Fires of Rubicon. I streamed very briefly yesterday, but had to cut it short within about three or four minutes of starting, so I just decided to uh, cut it short and not do an upload. But what I did was I altered my mech a little bit after buying some parts, and just to kind of show off what I got was I got this laser shotgun in the right arm, then in the left arm I got this explosive thrower, and then over here this um, spread bazooka, I forgot that, what that one was called, and then a diffuse laser cannon. And I played a little bit of the uh, wall climber level looking to see if I could find the log on it, and did a few other alterations and um, I think because I had loaded up a different mech, that's why my color scheme changed a bit. So we'll play with it because I kind of like it. Like I think I said before, it reminds me a bit of Megatron or something. <laughs> All right, let's uh, go ahead and check this out. So we don't want to do the new mission quite yet because it's the one with the really tough boss fight. And instead, I want to do a little bit of battle log hunting. And it was here on Operation Wall Climber. So I'd already explored a little bit of this area in the previous stream. Um, but like I said, only maybe a minute or so. So I'm going to skip over some of the spots that I already looked in, mostly around the starting area. And we'll go straight to combat and taking out a few enemies. These uh, different items that I use are pretty intriguing. And uh, I'm looking forward to uh, showing them off. Getting hit pretty hard already, so I have to watch out. Oops. This thing has no armor on it. Might have to switch out to tank or something to uh, have any kind of long time, long term viability because the weapons are so heavy. All right, we're gonna do some more looking around for our log as soon as we get rid of some of these things that are doing heavy damage to us. Oh, and I want to fall down. It's possible it's down here though, so let's check it out. Laser shotgun's pretty fun. Looks like if you hit them with enough rays from the laser uh, rounds, that it will take out some of these smaller guys in one hit. There you go. So I wonder if our log is down in here. Seeing anything though. Alright, time to use these chicken legs. There we go. Didn't quite make it. Bummer. Hit me. There we go. See what else we can find. Aha! There's something. I don't think I've picked up whatever that is for. We'll take out some of the enemy uh, turrets first. Make this area a little bit safer to be in. I 
Okay, nice. this one guy at? Aha, here's the combat log guy. No, how did I get a log off of him? That's interesting. G4's last words. Let's see. For one of the red guns, another apparently just before their death. Glazu, I'm telling you, man, you gotta give Michigan a chance. He's different from the suits at HQ. Look, I know he's an asshole, but he's looking out for us, you know. Almost like we've got a family here, hey? Man, if there's anyone who deserves punching out, it's a freak because he sent us on a suicide mission. He picked a good day to go AWOL. I was shy. That was it. Okay, well, we got our logs, so now we can just go ahead and continue on to the end of the level. We won't worry too much about taking out anything other than what we have to. Ooh. Oh, I better watch out. I'm gonna have to redo this with Hank on or something because this is just too much damage too quickly. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is sad. Here we go. Should be at a checkpoint, I think. Good. Now it won't be a big problem if we lose anything, because I think I should still have the log. Do you read me? This is V4 Rusty. You're fast. I guess you're sharper than they say. I'll have to step up my own game. A numbered Vesper is an elite. But remember, even Balaam couldn't crack the wall. Don't count on him too much. Okay. There might be actually a uh, supply drop here in a second too. I'm biased a little time. I doubt I'll be able to beat it with this current build, but we'll see what we can do. That's the Juggernaut, a heavy mobile cannon. I wouldn't recommend taking it head on. It won't be able to keep up with Steel Haze. I'll distract it while you hit its blind spot. Watch out, it's coming. There we go. We'll be able to take it on. Oh, we got stuns back to back. Look at that. How did I lose that? Such a big enemy. Nope. 
this again. Got him already. Wow. This is a pretty high damage build. I like it. Too bad I'm a lot like a blast cannon, cannon though, with the uh, amount of damage I can take from being solo. one less repair kit, but no problem. I wonder if I got a higher rank. Confirmed. Juggernaut destroyed. That's fun. Operation Wall Climber is a success. That pilot, Rusty, it seems he knew who you really are. It won't matter. I've taken that contingency into account. Okay, let's see. I got 323, so that's good enough for me. Analog. Hopefully that completes it for that mission. Alright, let's see. Uh, I think I may also want to do some OS tuning. Let's see what we might want to do. Weight control. Yeah, I don't think I want to bother with that. Let's see what else. So. Manual aiming, quick turn, yeah, that's not much of a need for me. Um, let's go, yeah, none of the system unlocks. Pulse armor seems to be fine so far. Um, I do wonder if it would be okay to, or worth upgrading to that, so spending 100,000, but let's look at what else we have. It, oh, I did have energy weapons maxed out, that's part of why. I was doing so well on that because everything was energy. Um, the damage tuning, so I kind of feel like in general, if I do respec, maybe keeping damage tuning up and spreading out the energy weapons uh, expenditure a little bit there. And let's see what else. Maybe repair kit optimization can go down one level to boost more damage on other things but yeah we'll see um okay so i do want to buy parts as we go along that was kind of the mission that i stated in a previous stream is that i wanted to kind of keep buying stuff up as we went so what would be we could probably clear out a fair number of the heads if we just started buying them um but what else do we have Oh, this looks like an interesting uh, core. Too bad I can't use it with the current thing. And this sounds like it would be a fairly good upgrade in defense. Um, so maybe I'll save up for that. It's only 4,000 away. And it looks like I could use my current parts with it. So let's do another mission. And let's look for another battle log too. Oh, there's another one I need to get on this one apparently. Huh. I guess let's uh, check it out again and see if we can find it. Um, we'll just do it like we had it before because I think that if I could make it once, I could probably make it again without having to go to tank. So let's see. Uh, I'm surprised I already had a B ranking for this level too. All right, battle log. Where are you hiding? Pretty sure there's nothing back here, but I'm checking again. Yeah. There's nothing back here. Okay, nothing over in this area. Oh nice, I didn't have to do anything and I got 2400 credits. 
<laughs> Pretty sure I'm going to. Be climbing that wall all day, every day. down in here a little bit, but let's look a little bit more. Just in case. Because it was a normal looking MT that had the log last time. Okay, let's see. The supply Sherpa area is going to be the end of it, so we just need to take our time, I think, and we'll find whatever is hiding that log. Still a few little nooks and crannies to explore, so let's look a little bit deeper in this area. I feel like it's got to be out in the open. There's also that little bit of indoors area where there's a few MTs dawdling around. Um, I feel like it's got to be out over here while the action is. Maybe there's something over here in the beginning area. I get a lot of flight time with this build, it's awesome. way up there at the top. I don't think I've ever noticed that. That's what I've never got before. It's got to be whatever that thing is. We'll go get it. That's that thing that's been hitting me so hard that it knocks the wind out of me every time. We'll go find it. I need to recharge our boosters. Oh, there's the upper area limit. So that's why I've never been up to it. So how do I get up to it? Still not. some way to this, huh? Let's see. Go look over here for a minute. Nope. Another world boundary. So we know there was something up there. That guy. I think somehow I gotta destroy it. Dang, what is hitting me now? Oh, that's a few more of those things. Okay, we'll take them out too. Oops, all done. I think it's impressive even without explosives, meaning that I can blow those up. Ah, what about this jumper? Let's see how that gets us. Yeah, still not high enough to get whatever is up there at the top. 
Maybe I just have to clear the tetrapod and it'll let me go up there. out so we'll have to worry about Melon during this part of the fight. Right shoulder ammunition at 50%. Okay. So your campaign is shocking all on this guy. Okay, apparently I activated uh S word. <laughs> See if we can get up here. That significantly reduces the threat in the city. Access the bulkhead and break into the wall. Okay, now we know we can do that, but let's see if it'll let us fly up high first. No. Nope. Alright. So let's look down here in the city a little bit more just in case the log is over here. Cruise on by. At thirty percent, oh, this would be embarrassing. I don't want to die. See anybody though? Okay. Who else? Like one of those turrets is still around. Hmm. Wonder if you have to do something special to get some enemy to come out. down there in the city still. Okay, I think 
think this is the group of NTs that I've already dealt with before. is firing at me now. Can't believe that missed. <laughs> okay. One more. Alright, I don't think there's really anything left out here. Um, oh. There's that big turret. I bet that's what the other combat log is. How I get to it, I have no clue. I'm gonna try flying out way over this way. Oh, okay, I hit a world boundary just about as soon as the words left my mouth. I don't even know if the missile will go up there. We'll see if we can survive the next area or two. If not, we might look up where the log hunt is in this and then we'll beat it. There's just an enemy like kind of sitting amongst the crates somewhere, perhaps. Somebody was taking some pot shots at me. There we go. Wow, interesting. Environment's a little bit destructible. Interesting. Okay. There's no way out of this room, right? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's move on to the next area. Shot at you yet. <laughs> okay. Let's look around a little bit now. Oh, look at this guy. I don't think I recognized that from previous rounds, didn't notice it. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them actually in the crates. That's cool. If you take your time and look around, you'll notice a lot of interesting little details in some of these levels. Alright, well, I don't see anything else though. So, let's just hang out here for a moment. And I wonder if I open this door, if anything else opens up, perhaps. A clever way to hide access to an enemy with a log. Doesn't look like any way to get up there either. So let's look in here now. There should be a lift nearby. The target is close. Okay. go. I'm going to just kind of spin the camera around and see if there's an off ramp. So we're on level four and I still wonder if taking out that cannon would get me um, that last log. It's log, log. It's big, it's heavy, it's wood. Nice. 
nothing. It'd be clever if that door back there would open. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anything. It looks like going to the boss is really my only thing to do left. Wise words of Yoda. Thing to do left. <laughs> Just jump off. Oh, interesting. There's this little hottie area here. I wonder if it can even target me. This makes me wonder if I can get access to that weapon that was shooting me earlier. Maybe it is out here somewhere. Personally, it's not a big deal if I don't beat the Juggernaut, because I'm after the Log Hunt. Now that's intriguing. On this side, you can go up a little bit. I don't think I could get anywhere on a ledge on the other side. Interesting. I never noticed this little area on the other side. Fascinating, really. Okay, let's see. Anything else? No, it doesn't look like it. Huh. You'll have to look up about that other log. I'd love to unlock a new weapon today if time permits. You got me. Hit me several times there. There we go. Okay, sweet. I think I see where the log is now. Okay, I just looked it up. Let's try it one more time. This stream is going to be all about Operation Wall Climber, apparently. Um, let's see. Your objective is to take the lip we'll move pretty quickly through it so that we can get this one done. Main system, activating combat mode. Gatling can 
units protecting the city, and the Baus Tetrapod MT further in. There's heavy fire coming from up top. 621, keep an eye out for cover. You'll never climb the walls, Corporation Dog! Still got me. somewhere along the way from what I saw online let's see is it over here ah here it is wow that's really well hidden domains writings one uh, from thumb domain father of the liberation front the coral is Rubicon's blessing the land is frail and withered yet within lurks limitless abundance and just a single drop it's just our flesh and blood coral abide with Rubicon Okay, let's see. I think that was just one of the logs. Let's see what else there is. I don't know if that counts as... Maybe that is the last one though. Let me double check. Might be yet. I'm just going to complete the mission. Seeing that wasn't a combat log, I bet it'll count towards my logs. Period. They did pretty well. Remember the first time I fought one of those and it was so hard. <laughs> Score will do a resupply. I need to remember to use my pulse armor too. I keep forgetting I have it because I'm so used to having the terminal armor. Like I said before, I really wish that we could get OS chips to maximize our build. Kind of stinks having to pay 100 grand if I want to make a change.
I bet with the right build I could get an S rank on this level. really fast. Love watching the uh, shoulder weapons retract. That looks cool. Oh, I got an S rank. Wow. Nice. I really did not expect that. Cool. So let's see if that cleared off the uh, mission for needing to get everything else. Uh, complete. Good. Good, good, good. All right. What else can we try to get a battle log on? Infiltrate grid 86. Alright, I think I remember this one. I think it's the one with the sea spider, right? No, it's Ocean Crossing. It has that. Okay, yeah, we could take a look at this one and see what we can find. Um, but I've got enough money now. I can buy a few more parts. So let's get in there and buy that core that we were interested in earlier. So let's go in and let's see, it was the VP40S, right? I'm just going to compare the differences and defenses real fast. So I think that this one was energy shortfall, that's what it was. So this one will actually work. So we'll buy it, the VP40S. And how about arms? Um, I think everything was overburdened or... Oh, interestingly, this one works. The Basho. I think at that one... Oh, it's a good weight change. Okay. 10,480. Thankfully, my weapons are kind of lightweight, so maybe swapping out to that could make a difference. And how about... Anything else? I guess we might as well go ahead and buy the FCSs and that'll complete that. And we could do the same for the boosters. There we go. Okay. So let's uh, change up our build a little bit here. Um, we will try out, excuse me, VP40S. How does that do on weight? Uh, increases weight a good bit, so we won't be flying as much, but will this make it worth it? Try to see what it pluses and minuses are. So it'll be less nimble overall, but a fair bit more defense. So let's do it. And then on the arms, we'll see if we want to do similar there. With the Bashos? Yeah. Okay. Decreases the anti-energy a little bit, but otherwise I think we'll be okay. 
All right, and for SCS, I um, wonder if we want to do short range or close range. Let's see what the best is. Abbott, looks like it. Okay, so a few piece, pieces have been changed and how about legs? I wonder if we have any legs that can support us other than the spring chicken because they're just not my favorite. I don't know, the mind alpha will work. Okay, that's a weight improvement and defense improvement in a couple areas. And this is an improvement too, but it's a lot heavier. Hmm. I think I remember these being kind of slow too. So maybe we'll stick with mind alpha. They're pretty nimble. Okay. And really don't care for the finder eye, so let's see if we can swap it out for something else. Maybe the Melander. Hmm. This one has a drop in defense by a good bit and AP and let me double check what AP is. Resilience of the part. Okay. All right, well, let's try this out. This is quite a big change up. Different core, different head, different legs, different arms, and a different FCS. So might as well be a whole new build at that point. All right, um, so, oh yeah, this is my build with all the stickers on it. <laughs> Forgot about that. Um, let's try out that infiltrate the grid level. We're going to look for the battle log here. Let me handle getting us into the grid. Commencing. Main system activating combat mode. Oh yeah, this level has a complex layout. I think this is the one that has Carla and Elm on it, if I remember right. So we're going to have to do a lot of looking around. Start off in the lower level and then we'll pop up every time we need to to take out an enemy. Could be as simple as I didn't collect a uh, MT's records or could be any number of things. seeing anything now. Oh wow. That's a pretty good job. <laughs> Again, I'm amazed at that missed. <laughs> What else we had to find? I guess we might as well take this guy out too. There's a lot of little MTs here. I wonder why. Just finish looking at the bottom and we'll go up high. Oh, there's some more of them deploying. survived the full shotgun blast. Yeah, look, there's a whole other area over here. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to look up where to find the log for this level because it's pretty complex. Don't know for sure though. More enemies coming. Oh, these are up high there. Missing again. Okay. Looks 
looks like that thing. Already. Oh, I shouldn't let him hit me with that chainsaw. Is this Come whole other area? Did I just get turned around? I think I just got turned around. Yeah. Let's take a look on the over, Raven. Okay. Um, yeah, so nothing so far. Hopefully, I didn't pass up the log. I've gathered data on the woman from that broadcast. That was Carla, leader of RAD, a formidable dozer faction. She joined them three years ago. Now this looks like a promising area. Hey, look at this dude. Interesting. Didn't expect that. I saw him, but didn't think it was an enemy. back over here for a moment. See what's going on back here. Ah, there's something new. Right hand definition at 50%. Interesting. Let's keep looking. I'm guessing we're gonna hit a boundary though. Interesting. Yeah, I haven't seen a lot of these enemies. I've only played this level a couple times, so. And there's a moving elevator part. That looks promising. I think I see a robot or something down here. Fascinating. Ah, I wonder if this is it. Those are ravings. Appears to be left over a log of chatter between allies. Those coral millworms, they're just kind of, you know, a bunch of crap is what they are. A teeny tiny shot of coral diluted all the way down until there's damn near nothing left. No one's getting high off that. That's why we're different. You gotta take Rubicon's blessings raw. Oh man, there's nothing like it. Damn right. Hits your brain with a pop and a sizzle. Interesting. Um, I feel pretty lucky to have found that spot because that was fairly well off the beaten path. We'll keep looking for other things. Well, this might be it. Let me uh, pause for a minute and check my list just to see. Oh, there's several, but yeah, may just have to look around a little bit more and uh, we'll see if we find them. If not, that's okay. Better recharge. Love how complex this level is. 
All right. There should be a few MTs down here somewhere. Yeah, here's a couple guys. Seeing much of anything else. We may go ahead and finish the mission. I think there's a boss fight at the end of it with that incinerator thing. have a few heavy roller ones come out as soon as we try to open the door so we'll take care of them Cruise on through. Oh, interesting. I don't think I noticed this little area back here. Let's take a look. Ah! A weapon. A wrecker. Cool. I don't know what other weapons I haven't found yet. Here it looks like we can only go up and forward. Just double checking. Didn't expect to find any weapon today, so that's really cool. Oh neat. I don't think I've ever noticed this place either. Looks like another weapon. Oh, something got me. Well, cool. I had no idea this was back here. Alright, let's see. I guess we gotta go back out to the molten lava area, so let's get over to it. Yeah. Where is there anything else out here? Okay. Cool. 
Got that right, Carla. This is the part with the explosives dangling from the ceiling, if I remember correctly. Looks like we can't go this way. Not this way. We might take out that MT in just a moment. Let's see what's back here, though. Oh, good. Whole nother thing. Another wrecker. Cool, cool. the explosives part. Don't want to fall into their little trap. Alright, let's see what we have enough ammo to take this out. Hello. There we go. Oh, no one ran out of ammo before I can beat this boss. Here we go. I wonder if that'll let me through the door. Surely there'll be a resupply. Time for the resupply. Just in time, too. Time for the You're bus fight. I have no idea how this villain is going to fare against it.
such a crazy robot. In case I get stunned, I don't want it to get me. <laughs> Go ahead and repair. Ooh. It's starting to hit me now. There we go. Easy peasy. That build definitely did better than the previous build with all of its differences. Too. Head, legs, and the core. That's all a new set. We'll check it out. Oh, so that's like uh, the one that I think maybe Chatty has for its head. Yeah, let's see. Good AP, higher defense on kinetic and explosive. But yeah, I don't know if it's totally relevant compared to what I've already got. Let's look at this core. Ooh, it's a lot heavier, another 4,000. So, defenses don't even go up that much either. Well, the anti explosive is good, I guess. So, that's not terrible. Now, how about the arms? I oh, know it was legs actually. Let's look at the legs. Um Yeah, I don't see it. Maybe previous to getting all these other things, if I'd found those parts uh earlier in the game, they would have been a good upgrade at the time, so I guess that's too bad. Um let's go ahead and buy another part or two if we can afford it, and we'll call it a stream. So let's go ahead and get these two generators. Actually we'll buy the 241 just in case it's good. And um, there's one more thing I was going to check. I was going to see if maybe we finish that infiltrate. If not, I'll go back and play it again. Ah, it's still pending. Yep, so it looks like we still got another thing or two to find. That's okay. We'll go ahead and roll credits for the day and say thank you for watching. This has been SCR Rank. Follow me on Mesa on Twitch and YouTube and I'll have an upload on YouTube soon. Thanks. Have a good one.